Hey guys, welcome to part 14 of the Android 2 Min tutorial series. Decision making is very important in applications. An example of a decision your future apps might make is, do not allow this user to log in because they've entered incorrect details. Conditional statements such as if statements are used in Android to achieve this control. In this tutorial, we experiment with if statement by creating a number guessing game. Create an edit text and set the ID to input. And then create text view with the ID set to message. Finally, create a guess button with the on click set to guess clicked. Now head over to the main activity. Create a member variable for the edit text and the text view and assign both variables in on create. We also need a member variable to hold the number the user is trying to guess. Make the number 5. Now when the user enters a number and clicks the OK button, we need to check if their number is equal to the number to guess. This is where an if statement comes in useful. Store the number the user has guessed in an int variable and remember to first convert it to int. An if statement is written like this. If the condition written in this parenthesis results to true, then instructions within the curly braces will be executed. In this scenario, the condition we are checking for is if the guess number is equal to the number to guess. We check equality by using two equal signs. Now if the condition is true, we want to change the text of the message text view to correct. For the guessing game, we also want to tell the user if their guess number is too high or too low. We can use an else if to achieve this. An else if will be checked if the condition above is not true. So let's check if the guess number is less than the number to guess. Now again, change the text to too low if that happens. Finally, an else is what happens if all the above conditions are false. It is written like this. And in this scenario, if all conditions are false, it means the guess number is higher than the number to guess. Print out message saying too high. Run your program and test it. You should see it should shows the correct message. That's it for this tutorial, guys. Thanks for watching.